They're called ball pythons because when they get scared, they curl up into a ball, mm-hmm. which honestly is not a very good defense, especially <laughs> not a good defense for poachers um, because they'll go out into the wild and then find ball pythons and they're so easy to and just And then you can play up. basketball yeah, with the, them. Well, <laughs> hello. We're here. Hi. Guys, I don't really need to. I mean, you guys can introduce yourselves if you want. I don't think you really have to, but go for it. Go oh. ahead. You start. I'm Jaden. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that's it. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's it. <laughs> I'm Jacob Alpharad. I make silly videos on YouTube. Mm-hmm. Jaden also does. I do do that. There's your introduction. <laughs> and we here. just like animals. We're putting on gloves because we're going to meet Georgie. They have already seen Georgie. He has been leaked. Okay. But that's because he's right freaking here and mm-hmm. he's really hard to miss. This is Georgie. Georgie. <laughs> <laughs> He's an African bullfrog. I feel like him and Jaden in particular are going to get along really well. I have so much respect for Georgie. You want to hold him? I do. Okay. I would love to hold him. Okay. Put your hands up. Like, yeah. I think one thing yeah. Jaden and I had in common when we first <laughs> met was <laughs> Jaden's bird Ari and my cat Frazier yeah. also have very big man energy. Yeah. And Georgie's got big man he energy. He does have big man energy. I that love how he's got thing. like a little butt crack. You know, everybody mentions that. Everybody really likes Georgie's butt. Can you like see it? He does have a butt. A little butt crack. Such a guy. He's awesome, dude. He's so cool. Look at his little feet. Oh, look at those strong legs. Is he like average sized or like? <laughs> it's the second largest frog species in the world. Or like um, for his like species. For though. his species, honestly, I've seen bigger ones. I've put him in his dish because it's <laughs> <laughs> because it's time for him to eat. Which one of you wants to feed him? I want to, but you I feel like you him. really want to. No, you should feed him. <laughs> if you want to, just say it. You can feed him. Okay, I'll feed him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I'm going to give you it, but it's kind of yuck. Okay. It's a skin fine. mouse. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. So you're going to feed him with tongs because okay. he doesn't have teeth, but he does have oh. bony protrusions that mm. hurt mm-hmm. a lot if he bites you. Okay, chat, if you don't like looking at the mouse, don't look at it. Okay, so you're going to hold it in front of George. Uh-huh. And then... Like, you dangle it in front, man. and then he'll take it, and then you can let it go. Sometimes whoa, it takes a couple whoa. attempts. He, he jump scared me. He's oh. Georgie is a is a sit and wait predator. I He's see that. <laughs> looking at like a popsicle. <laughs> he, <laughs> in the of, wild, he come on. He sits and he waits. Come on, for the Georgie. food to come to him, and it really has to. Oh, he's like pissed you're, at me. You're, I'm, you're I'm, pissing him yeah, off, Jacob. <laughs> it's, it's right here, buddy. Two hours later. Oh my God, you've done it! Yay! Yay. Yum, Georgie! Delicious! You look at his little teeth. He looks so proud! <laughs> so I've cute, won! Dude. He's so cute. Are you kidding me? The apex predator. Yes. Spaghetti time! I think from the moment we walk in the room, I saw Georgie, and that he had big man energy. It was an aura, you know? It, is. it just hits you, and you go, what is that? Where is it coming from? Next ambassador? Ooh, you're gonna be excited. What oh, I can't wait. Just- it's a reptile. <gasps> is it a skink? He guessed it so fast. <laughs> I love skinks. Can one you guess day what I kind of skink? One. I would lose my mind if you guessed I want a blue skink. tongue skink. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, is it a blue tongue skink? <laughs> is it really a blue tongue? <gasps> Look at this guy. What's his name? Toaster Strudel. Toaster Strudel. <laughs> <laughs> this is Toast. You can hold him. Oh my god. You want. So Toast. Blue tongue skink. Hello, oh, Toaster Strudel. It's an honor. I have never been with such reptile people. This is so <laughs> fun. This guy is so cool. Yeah, he's really cute. Hey, buddy. Toaster Strudel. <laughs> Look at his blue tongue, Jacob. I see it. I love camera. how tiny the, the arms are. <gasps> You're going to die. Okay. I'm just going to. Look at this. I'm going to let I was him... looking at those. Are those his? <laughs> yeah. His little gloves? <laughs> his gloves. <laughs> his gloves. Chat, you want to see Toast gloves? They're a prized possession. Toast? The Toast gloves. Oh, look at him slither. Whoa, 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 buddy. Whoa, whoa, buddy. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> the little mittens. Toast is a blue tongue skink. Uh, he likes to eat snails in the wild. Mm-hmm. Um, and I tell people, people that don't like snails are gardeners, right? Because they eat their plants. Yeah. So then they'll put pesticides on the snails, kill the snails with chemical pesticides. Then Toast eats the snails and eats the pesticides and then Toast dies. 
So look for natural alternatives uh, to pesticides if you guys can. Same with rodenticides. If you I use rat poison, want toaster or strudel to die. That's never. what I'm saying. So uh, try to use natural alternatives to pesticides, rodenticides where you can. Cause what would you recommend? I was just about to ask. You know, Buddy, he's there's moving. a bunch of different stuff for gardening. He People use sew. like eggshells and cayenne mm -hmm. pepper, but it depends on oh, the pest you're well, trying delicious. to control. All right, guys. Toast has Bye, made some toast. friends. Goodbye, Toast. I'm your biggest fan, Toast. Actually, you might. I'm so cute. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, oh, look at his little snaggle God. mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you love the snaggle mouths. I love it. Toast actually has mega fans here today. It's really exciting. Oh, Toaster Strudel and the snail drama. I think he's. Which side is he on, though? I think Toaster Strudel. He eats Strudel. snails, though. I feel like it's the same thing we s humans say on like, you know, eating cows and stuff. We can we can have all the opinions we want, but at the end of the day, we well, are the ones eating. Well, them. here's the difference though. Like we have like societal standards and like ethical, moral, internal conflicts, stuff like that. I don't mm -hmm. feel like Toaster Strudel is bound to the same moral compass as a human being is. But I think Toaster Strudel would want to be the best skink that they can be. And that's eating snails? And that is eating snails. Yeah. Next friend. Ooh. Patchy. Patchy. We. she's only got one eye? That's why her name's Patchy. Patchy. Oh, what happened in Patchy's past lives? So Patchy a was- warrior. Life of crime. <laughs> a survivor. <laughs> Patchy was bred for color for the pet trade. Uh -huh. um, and when you breed for color, sometimes um, you get genetic defects. So she was born with one eye. Oh, she's so soft. Yeah. Um, so then they couldn't sell her to pet stores. Mm -hmm. And that's how we got Patchy. They're called ball pythons because when they get scared, they curl up into a ball. Mm -hmm. Which honestly is not a very good defense, especially <laughs> not a good defense for poachers um, because they'll go out into the wild and then find ball pythons and they're so easy to and just And then you can up. play basketball yeah, with the, them. Well, <laughs> um, I had a friend in like middle school who mm -hmm. was like fiending the, the stocks of the pet trade. Mm -hmm. And I was like, looking back, why? But I mean, reptiles go for a lot of money though. Yeah, no, he was yeah. rolling in it at like age 14. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't even, I just assumed that you were fine holding a snake. Sorry, I didn't even ask you. I was just like, No, it's okay. I can hold anything. Is. Okay, cool. You guys want to see how big Patchy was when we first got her? Yes. Tiny like little? a tiny worm? Tiny I'm going to put her on the table. I'm going to show you the first shed we have from right, Patchy. Patchy oh. Little baby Patchy. Look so how tiny she was. Do they like, so is it more that they get bigger or longer? Or like, both. Is that stupid? No. Okay. <laughs> no, they get, <laughs> they get both bigger and longer. Patchy, can I do a comparison? I'm what a gonna, stupid like... question. Yeah, I mean, I was, because I was thinking like, uh, it's okay. <laughs> Patchy definitely has a past life of crime. Am I just typecasting them because they only have one eye? I feel like if Patchy were to commit a crime, it would probably be... I think embezzlement. Embezzlement, yeah. for sure. Yeah. Yeah. It just feels right. Mm -hmm. Plus, it's like a pretty badass crime of yeah. all of them. Yeah, of course. You hear the the typical like murder, murder, it's kind of cringe. Yeah. Yeah. This oh. is Barbara. 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 She's beautiful. Look at her little eyeballs. Whoa. She's so shy. She's she looks prehistoric. Hi. Hello. Hey guys. <laughs> yeah, this is one of the largest roach species in the world. This one's like really big. Not all of ours are this big. Mm. What is she named after? Uh, she has little barbs on her legs. Oh. oh. You see those? I see, yeah. Because uh, they're really, here, guys, look at her barbs. Um, they're really good at climbing. They can climb glass. Like, Whoa, we have to put Vaseline cool. in their enclosure that's so they really, don't climb she's very up talented. the glass. You see the little barbs? That's really funny. <laughs> so Big, beautiful woman she is. <laughs> that's very nice of you to say. I th she's empowering. Would you like to hold her? I'm scared, but I would hold her. <laughs> okay. I would hold her, too. Okay. You can go first. Okay. I've been holding them all. Hello. How is she? Yay, friends. She's... Hanging. She's a chiller. They're, They're so chill, right? They're so yeah. docile. Yeah, what are her tinier arms in the um, front? Just for feeling. Mm. Um, and then she's got mouth parts underneath. It's kind of hard to see, though. She's like patting you. Yeah, thank you. Can they're kind of cool. Myth bust the nuclear explosion thing and cockroaches for me? Yeah, um, they can actually withstand, I think, about 10 times the amount of radiation that we can, which Ooh. is incredible. But they can't survive the actual impact of a nuclear explosion. That's, that <laughs> that, makes, that sense. makes sense. So that could, the, the myth comes from that they can withstand a lot of radiation. Yeah, mm. so put us in the radiation chamber. Yeah, And they, they outlive win. me every time. By gotcha. a lot, yeah. Big bird! Hi, chicken! 
Stompy loves the rain. He loves water. Oh. Aww. Hello. What a little How wet dog. You? Look at his hair. A wet dog. <laughs> he's nice. You guys want to pet him? Yes. Normally he doesn't feel like this. He's all wet. <laughs> wow, he just feels like a dog. Yeah. This little dog guy. This is an emu. I didn't say. I don't know if you guys knew that. Mm -hmm. um, an emu is an Australian bird, um, and he likes hugs. Look. Can I have a hug? Oh, oh, that's so cute. Yeah, he has only been raised by people. Mm -hmm. So I got him when he was like 14 days old. Oh, oh my god, yeah. how big was he? Watermelon. Huh. Do you guys want to give him a hug? I would yes. love to. Oh, he dropped the carrot. I dropped the carrot. Um, you kind of just how go you in, initiate? and then I'll help guide his head on top of your shoulder. Okay. I'll, I'll that's bend down. Right. Oh, that's nice. Oh, Tommy. buddy. <laughs> cute. Oh, it's looking in the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> hey, do I cr crouch down for him? Here you go. Oh, hello, buddy. Oh, <laughs> oh friend. I think this is the most intimidating animal we have. <laughs> oh, I think he's awesome. He looks crazy. It's I so love weird. his feet, though. You'll Little love dinosaur I like toes. The, Check out his wings. <laughs> the dinosaur oh, tracks. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> the wings. Stop Did you see, Where Jacob? you go? What the hell? <laughs> I tripped. Oh, how embarrassing. If you guys want to feed the donkeys, this is jalapeno. 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 Um, I'm going to give you these, and you can just hold your hand flat and kind of tuck your thumb. Like this. Like, oh shit. Just like hold your thumb close to you. Okay. Me. I've got a clipped ear. Um, and they're real shy, so you might need to let them come up to you. Um, Serrano is much more Garrett. confident. The brown one. I'll take Serrano. Hello, buddy. Anything special to do here? Brave. There we go. Jalapeno, Are you, you want? A little purple guy. I'm sorry. <laughs> He's like, you can have this one if you like. Jalapeno. <laughs> you want carrot? Come here. Come on. Aww. Oh, oh. <laughs> so much lip. <laughs> um, so they were gonna be sold, the very, very lucky ones, the few lucky ones as pets. Um, but most of the time for like cat kibble, dog kibble. Oh no, I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> oh, uh, it's and, just not going right. Oh, no. <laughs> um, or glue or for <laughs> traditional medicine. Oh, jalapeno. Yeah, I like how so Stompy they, just kind of lurks. He's, He's like, don't forget about me over here. <laughs> Winnie the Moo! This is Winnie. <laughs> she, she'll have us come to her. <laughs> you can pet her For wherever some she's For reason, she was so much smaller from so much further away. <laughs> she got like exponentially bigger the closer I got. She's pretty big. This is a red Angus beef cow. Um, so I got her I off of the a coat. beef operation in Oklahoma. So she would have been slaughtered for beef. Red you Angus, Black Angus, Angus beef. So You're a shoe. survivor, Winnie. Oh, a shoe. She is a survivor. It's Nike. It's amazing. Um, for Winnie, we teach people about the beef industry. Mm -hmm. She burps and farts a greenhouse gas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> cows, you know, with methane. Yeah. Um, and so the beef demand is so high that we have so many cows. We're producing a ton of methane. Um, and it's a huge oh, contributor hello. to climate change. So yeah. I don't tell people to go vegan, but I do generally... Um, recommend that they eat less beef yeah probably the most green thing you could do yeah yeah I um i personally actually don't eat too much red meat mm -hmm. or i try not to eat red meat at all actually but Jaden is uh you've you've been uh i've been vegan vegetarian for like seven years yeah. oh cool do you guys want to brush her yes brush. i want to do everything possible yeah i just like okay. watching stompy in the Stand distance by. i'm so intrigued <laughs> he's always just a little just around He's got things to explore. He's got the world to see. I think Stompy's my favorite guy. So She's ready. <laughs> she looks like she's just happy to enjoy it. Oh, wow. She oh, really I see her. Like oh, my God. It. What a beautiful smile. Winnie, it's an honor. Teeth. teeth. Check out these teeth. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Here, I'll get the other side. You get the other side. Yay, happy baby cow. Oh. She's amazing. Oh. oh. I love cows so much. And they're so cute. They have so much personality. She's yeah. so funny. I'm a huge Stompy fan. I came huge. back with merchandise. <laughs> he felt like everyone else. It, it was a real coming of age film, it felt like. That yeah. everyone else knew where they were supposed to be. And I just saw him wander from group to group trying to find <laughs> he was where he fits in. Mm -hmm. And I think that's beautiful. Because like, on a surface level, he truly doesn't 
but he's trying to find his place, and I feel like we can all learn from that. Yeah, I just love how we we I met we met Stompy, and then we started going to the donkeys, and you're mm. still talking about Stompy, and then we went to the cow, and you're like, actions speak louder Stompy. than words, <laughs> and every piece of his demeanor was telling a story, and I was just there to listen. Surprise, monkey! Oh, so fun! Whoa, that is tiny. Whoa, that's not even like a <gasps> thing I've seen before. <laughs> Oh my god, the face is tiny. That's Momo. That's like the same. Th Momo. Hey, Momo. Like yeah. Avatar. He's a black tufted marmoset. His hairs don't always stick out straight like that. It's a, <laughs> he's straight. It's a treat it. for you guys. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Oh, what he's a so pretty. Little, little pattern he's you little got. Papa. Look at him. He's yeah, so you can't curious. really touch him. He looks um, so wise. Uh, yeah, look how puffy. Oh my gosh. Wow. Or I? Okay, I can get behind this monkey. He's cool, huh? This um, guy's awesome. Yes, yeah, so this is a common marmoset. Uh, Momo's black tufted, or this is also called a white tufted. This one, when we got him, had almost no use of his back legs because oh, of wow. his metabolic bone disease. Um, so he's got, can you like not hide so they can see you? <laughs> this is, okay, this is, I like this guy. They're cool. They make terrible pets though. I um, believe it. Yeah, they're, they're seed dispersers, so in the wild, they're meant to eat a bunch of fruits and mm. swing around and shit Whoa. everywhere. Oh, he loves the cameraman, so he's gonna try to come <laughs> get the camera. I like how he has like a mustache. Yeah, I their didn't faces know he could are like. Rip on that, on the top of the door frame. Yeah, he's really good at climbing. Their faces are so small, but there's so much going on, you know? So much expression. Hi, little man. I love how puffy the tail is. Yeah, their tails aren't prehensile, so they can't grip things with them, but they're really good for balance. Uh, so they'll seed disperse in the wild. They'll eat a bunch of fruit, swing around, shit everywhere, and it helps with forestry growth, mm -hmm. um, which is great for forests, but terrible for your house. Um, yeah. And then it's just terrible for their welfare to be inside. You know, they like the elements and the sunshine. He really wants the camera. <laughs> Inching towards the camera. He's a star. My mm. one thing we gave our cat, our tiny little baby cat, she's an she's, iPad oh, baby. Oh, come over here. But oh, would you like to say hi? There was just hi. a game she plays that's just oh, a nice. lake, oh, and she dog. just taps fish, and that's hi, it. Uh -huh. Yeah, buddy. they might she be able to do it. that. Little man. Little man, Appa. He is tiny. He is. Very I have never little. seen a creature's face so human-like, okay, but go to so the small. Platform, and you can kind of roll him off onto there. Yeah. He does better with women. I would put him on you, but I don't fully trust him. So. <laughs> Ladies, man. Oh, if he goes on you, he's what it is. <laughs> he looked at him. He's look. like, he thought about it. He's, he's like, like <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a no. <laughs> oh, that's. Go. I've never thought about doing that. That's so smart. What is it? I always just tell people like you can't see him because he's on the camera. But yeah, there he is. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, he wants to see oh. the screen. Oh, okay. <laughs> he's like, who's this guy? Who's this other monkey? <laughs> Where did where he go? Is he still on me? He still is. The monkeys deserve iPad. I think the more traumatic your past is, the more... The more Apple products that exactly, you deserve. Exactly, you deserve. <laughs> I think especially the monkeys, like, I mean, any backstory for tr any tragic character in film, then they turn to an iPad character. It's like either that or a life of crime. So yeah. I feel like... You know, I mean, if half of my teeth rotted out, mm -hmm. I'd be pissed if I didn't have a MacBook, personally. Yeah. Um, so, two foxes, they're both American red foxes. He is gray, though. <laughs> kind of like Patchy, uh, he was bred for color for the pet trade. Mm. So, Finn was confiscated from the illegal pet trade in California by California Department of Fish and Wildlife. Oh, um, oh. And so he was bred to be a pet. Someone had him and then realized that they couldn't. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Here's some treats. Oh, Whee! what an eager social guy. Finn. Ball He's of so energy. fluffy. Yeah. Um, Fox is also scent post, so anything... Nice, thank you for showing them. Anything <laughs> new you put in the enclosure, they'll piss on, shit on, mm -hmm. um, just marking everything. Yeah. It's crazy, too. His face looks so different. I know yeah. you mm -hmm. don't see... Good job. <laughs> I it's know very round. See, yeah, they get shorter snouts. Yeah. When people breed foxes as pets, they want them to be, like, a bunch of different colors, and they want shorter snouts, and they want, like, floppy ears, and they want spots, and they want them to not be afraid of... You're being such a good teacher I feel like right if now. if you told me that this was a dog, I'd believe you. <laughs> yeah, they just start looking more and more like dogs. It's like a, a little husky. Yeah, I'd say he's mm -hmm. like kind of a weird looking dog, but I'd go, okay, I'm surely not qualified enough to doubt you. It's like, there's probably just like a mix of things in there. Yeah, what do I know? Right. It's just kind of, at the end of the day, it's just like, get a dog, you know? Mm -hmm. They just want them to be dogs. Yeah. So just get a dog. 
Uh, I just want to say thanks to Maya for having us out and the team. It was it was such an honor to no, get I to think meet so many animals. Thank you for showing me animals and giving me one to take home. <laughs> this has been a great day. I think a lot of people say that they want to save animals, save the world and all that stuff. And I think it's really cool to see someone and some organization actually do that. Yeah. Because everyone wants to. Like, if you give anyone the choice, would you like to save animals, yes or no? They say yes. Yeah. But it, it then they go, oh, uh, you know. Doing it's the hard yeah. part. Yeah. And she's doing it. She's doing it so well in such a... I like how it's so online, how people can interact and learn just at home and stuff. She's in the right business. She's going to go yeah, far. I agree. All right, that's everything. Thank you very much. Thank you.